TLO, what's pop? We are on Twitch. We are not live, but you can leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bells. Let's continue to grow the family from Chicago to the UK. Um, even though I moved to Florida, this is a documentary. Boys banged up. I don't know how much I like the name. It almost deserves a pause, but Boys Banged Up BBC. Northern Ireland High Bank Wood Prison Documentary Episode 1. This is off of This is off of DocTube So shout out DocTube if anybody's watching this go Oh, I'm already subscribed <laughs> Go sub to turn that on 60% of y'all are not subbed to me. That's crazy. We'd have a hundred plus thousand subs if everybody subbed. I don't know if y'all got these in the UK. I, I would assume you do. Let's get into this. <laughs> what is going on? I actually come up here on my 18th birthday. See you once you come out of here and come on down off drugs and all. See you once the door closes your head through your head. I'll just go a bit like. I don't feel like a human being. Same shit every single day. People here, it's like, you're in here, they're like automatic, Frank, we scumbag, we don't care at all, I feel it. You made me ask them what the time was. CBH. Care at all, I feel it. Honestly, this is not the snack that I should be eating while watching this. It's too crunchy, so I can't I can't hear it clearly. So I'm gonna wrap it up. I know some of y'all are very happy about that. Make sure there's no clicking. <clears throat> I actually like, oh yeah, it was definitely clicking. My bad. I thirst my wank bank. Like when they're in here. Sir, how are we? Living on stream. Are you joking? On how soon was it until you were attacked? Like five months. The best things about his bank, the road out of it. Hyde Bank in Northern Ireland houses young offenders and some who are awaiting trial. Most of these inmates are aged between 18 to 21. Their offences range from theft to murder. That sounds like 26 in California or Chicago. That's what, it, that's what, it, that's what, it, you know, same situation. But adults are there too. But you house with anybody from light offenders to murderer. Crazy. That's where they got the dookie glocks. Many make the headlines. I hear people say, do your work, which is do your time. You can't do a crime, don't do a time. Unless you're in for murder, you know one day you're walking out the other side of that fence. Shoot, even if, even for murder, 21 years later, you good. Hear about crime every day of our lives, so much so that we become sanitized. My name's Stephen Nolan. And as a local broadcaster, I hear callers regularly express their disgust at the offences these young guys commit. Our fate revolted. Sick. Sick. We are better than those people. Our fate revolted. I'm sorry, I know this is a serious matter, but I've never heard revolted used in a sentence. It just hit different when you hear it. Like, okay. Sick. Sick. We are better than those people. I'm going inside to meet the young offenders themselves. I was just sitting thinking, what the fuck, do you know what I mean, Nick? He doesn't even know me, and he's slobbering on a, on a show about me. I've been raging about it ever since. Oh, so you can't wait to meet him. For people like me on the outside, the story often ends when the young offender is locked up. 
But I want to find out what happens next. Right, Paul, see you tomorrow. Let's go! She just got her nails done. She knew she was about to. She couldn't wait to point for, to the screen in front of a camera. <laughs> That's crazy. The younger Fender's prison is bigger than Sweden's big. Bigger than. Was that Sweden? Bigger than Sweden's. Tiniest prison. It's like hard to be in here, like, you know, all your family, like, be outside. Can't do nothing, you know. Vlog every day, just do that same shit every single day. My name is Florin. I'm from Romania. Burgery bring me here, like. How old are you? You know, five months to go. Five months, and that's it. Yeah. Sorry, sometimes you get bored, like nothing, just make your head like away and just sitting and just watching the walls and that's it make you sad. Like, you know, sometimes just hug yourself, just make troubles, getting trouble, get, doing stupid shit we can't do, you know. Can we talk to them? <laughs> <laughs> 50 bellies? Can't give us a wiggle. They can't stand this dude, huh? That's why I, that's why that's where I come in. And I make it more bearable for y'all. I'm here for you. Hopefully y'all got some internet and YouTube in there. Who's that showing was it you calling me a fat? No, I said they're not well, man. We tight jeans. And you were the wiggle? No, I got the wiggle. What's the crack in here today? Same shit. Same shit. Everything's there. Basically. Mm. What's Camilla like in here? Like, do you come in on handcuffs and all that kind of oh, stuff? I you come in on the horse box now. You go in and you get fucking strip searched. Oh, I like. Humiliating. Fuck said, do you have a penis, dude? <laughs> I mean, so what's the difference of mine to yours, you know what I mean? Because someone else is looking at you. That's a bad I want to say that's probably an easy question to answer, but it'd be a plausible question to answer. Please look at this body, so this. Beach house, rock up, beach house, rock up. I'll take one behind the doors. Beach house, rock up. Shut his door. Yeah, Six feet like, nine. Your locked in, Steve. Six feet nine. Someone's fighting. There's someone's fighting. He's going to beat me up now. Wow, Steve. Wow, where are are you so allowed to be locked in a cell? So, no. What's, what's happening now? <laughs> if I tap and hit the alarm and all the screens go to the norm. And then they go so, does the alarm go now? Right now. Come on, here. Put my hair. How do you know when you can get out? Our doors are clear. Don't say beach beach house car around. I don't know. You might be locked in here. Hey, I know. Steve, the fear of, 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 of God came over his life when that door locked up. I think it was beach house lock, ding ding, ding click click, yeah, he was. So what are you gonna beat me up now? <laughs> right, no we'll get you sorted, don't worry. Right, Sean. Beach house will be exception of beat four. I just. I ain't never seen that happen in a dope prison where the prison people, where the, where the cameraman walked in and they all just got locked in the room. My fucking bed's a mess. Right, morning. So you've only got a wee shell, like so it is. You've your bed or, or two beds in here. Bunk bed, bottom bed, your sink, and your toilet, toilet in a room beside your head uh, isn't the best thing, like, so it's not that you feel uncomfortable with the like. But at the end of the day, you get your TV, you know, you get a nice sweet TV. 
So tell me about you then. Oh, I've been 19, so I've got uh, one year challenge for I was burglar at the start, and then the job did the criminal damage because never after the house like it. So what did you do? It was I went up to some someone's door and took a sledgehammer to it, right the place. That sounds crazy. Yeah. Do you realise how crazy that sounds? I don't know. We're gonna bust them up. So it was, but I was like, nah, fuck it. I'm not going to jail for a long time, like. But is that not like? <laughs> yes, that's. A bit extreme, it is all right. And had you been in much bother with the police before that? Oh, I was in bother before with common assault, criminal damage, all that other stuff, so it was just silly things. I lived in the country, my dad was a country fella, so he lived out in the back, I was holding the war. So I moved to a town and everybody was there and I get him in the wrong crowd and whatnot. And it, it... Have I never watched an Ireland thing? Like, what? The accent is crazy right now. I'm so focused on re even when I read it, I feel like I'm jumbling around because I'm listening and reading at the same time. It's hard to decipher the two. Like I feel I'm reading in an Irish accent. Like I I can't even read this. this. It felt good at the start, and then whenever all the police stuff was involved, and then I was just getting into trouble. Then they got there, and it took me to night to realize because this is my first time in here. It's took me all this time to realise, listen, I'm not going down this road no more. I was very nervous coming in here, but up here is sweet, so it is, it's not easy. But it's bearable, you could, you can live with it, you know what I mean? I didn't have that long of a sentence, I'd only... 12 months to 6, so it's not too bad, like. Oh, yeah, 50% there, huh? It's not bad. Sweet. Connor. He keeps a rough rap away. <laughs> <laughs> As you see, he has a rough rap away. <laughs> Connor keep the riff raff away. Does he keep your teeth away? Man, my John, you in there having a harder time than you need to already, man. My bad, dude. <laughs> As you see, he has a bit of muscle about him. You know what I mean? He's trying to make the gym smaller. Put a wee bit of timber on. You coming to the gym with us? I'm from the gym here, Gone, you got to close my door again for At the gym, I forget that I'm even in jail. I feel like you're out. The feeling that I call me, it's like, I'll meet them when, whenever we're out, both, both of us are out. Go to the gym every day, get your time by a lot faster, you know what I mean? Yeah, the gym is an escape for free people, so... I know it take y'all mind off being in jail in there, because for, for free people, go, like free as in me, people going to the gym, um, it's like a, it cleanses the mind. It's a relaxant. It's not a word, As but. I say, you can't beat the system, play the system, you know what I mean? Might as well play the game, right? Stop rocking like that, my boy. Make your time as easy as possible. And is this about the physical or the mental? Both. Keeps you healthy. Prison body is basically big upper frame and way tiny sticks for legs. That's how you know someone's been in the prison. <laughs> so, Johnny Bravo. Sometimes in the past, I've been arrested on the Friday. I woke up on the Sunday and went, why am I sitting here? <laughs> ah, you was turned. You was that drunk when you lost your memory and came back Sunday? That's what I heard. 
got arrested on a Friday, woke up on a Sunday, like, why am I still here? He was turned. Stay away from that spice. On Friday, I woke up on a Sunday and went, why am I sitting here? You just completely lose memory because you've had that many drugs or that much drink. It I've happened been there. so fast. It's like a car crash. It's it's happened before you realize what's happened and then you're back in here. You form a wee click. There's certain boys in here where you go, what? I mean, I'd rather have them boys I'd say because they're good crack. We look out for each other as well, like say. Ian didn't have to back out, I'd roll him and I'd roll there too. And Bro, if the subtitles were not here, I would not have known. Look for each other as well, like say. Ian didn't have like say Ben didn't have tobacco, I'd roll him an oldie roller rolly or two. Not tobacco, I'd roll him an eye rolly or two and they like there's a fella down the line, he's always asking for rollies, I rolled him an old tea bag there. See this prank she put in jail. Oh. Remember you smoked pubes? A person involved in unclean practices. Yeah, yeah don't worry. <laughs> Why? He had no tobacco one day, but he, got, he was asking someone whether I know where to land him to throw him down a fair. I will not fucking find so him, folks. Like. Someone got a rule in, put a wee bit of tobacco in and threw it down to him. See, at the start of the street, there was tobacco, like, that much in there, right? Smoked like that, and then fucking ripped it up. What the fuck's that, darling? I don't know what. I'll change your feud, son. <laughs> <laughs> the don't see, the that's not funny. I'd have to fight, dude. No, I'm not even condoning violence, you two, but... Nah, bro. That's that's wild. That's beyond me. So talk me through this. Ah, there's my wank bank. You have to have one of them, like, when you're in here. Do you all right? Get them in the newspapers when you get your visits, so you do, but... Say good location, best location about, no one knows where they are. Apart from that. BM <laughs> Station at 12. He's proud of that. BM Station. Clock, Fulton, me, Tamil, and Freeview. There's a Freeview on Tamil, Clock, 12 o'clock. That's close to getting a woman in here. Ten, half ten, goes quiet, so it does. No one speaks. Everybody's pumping one out, like, you know what, for a fact. <laughs> One night since I've came in here, the three months I've been in, someone's looked through my wee spy glass and they have been sitting there baiting it out over vape station. I was like, no way. And you go pure red in the sweats, baiting off you and they know rightly what you're at. You. No way. And you go no, no. There. Someone's looked through the wee spy glass and I've been sitting, I've been there. sitting there baiting it out. <laughs> over vape station. I was like, no way. You go pure red in the sweats, beating off you, and they know right. And they know rightly what you're at. You know what you I know mean? What you're at, you know what I mean? I know. It's yeah. thunder, and like, you, it just ruins your heart. It just ruins it. When you think about it, the other concert had no wank beside you, and it just puts you off, but it does all right. But what, what makes you think that, but? Because everybody goes quiet, you know? Yes, but it's getting the at time of night where people likes to turn off. It's not that you can turn on in jail and be like, what are we doing at 10 o'clock the night, walking up and down the room, yee ba, yee ba, get the music on. I don't know what they're like, but fuck it. You know what I mean? When they're 18 to 21, they're getting it in, and that is disgusting. They put a black light in there. It's crazy. Crazily unsanitary. We see when that door closes at what, 7 o'clock at night? Is it, not, is it not awful being locked up for, what is it, 13 hours? Yeah. Is that not crazy? Can I reflect? On what? My baby sleep for 13 hours. She go to sleep, I go to sleep. Yeah, I'll be back on some evening. 
What's heavy work mean? You start there with him in your head, robbing him down. And then you end up cutting her wrist, and you'll do mine. Mine's like... Cutting her wrist, and you'll... Heavy whacking? I thought they was talking about... I do mine. Mine's like... can't fucking put someone behind bars and expect them not to go mad after a while. Hell, I'm sorry for slapping these. Red? Fucking me, lad, I'm helping. An annoying person? He's the heavy worker on the run. <laughs> That's the one who smashes room up all the time. Oh. He's took all he has he fit last night and threw all his dinner over everyone. Stay in my way, tap. All chili sauce on it. I had to spat in his face, like. They were disgusting, but there was only thing I think I'd only cut and hit him, he's a brain injury. I'll let you send the wee shaker here. Yeah. See the water? There's a water made up in my piss. <laughs> Shut up, we stayed in my piss and that's what he did. There's four episodes of this out. It's funny, but it's like it, it takes away from the reaction when I have to read everything. Like, you feel what I'm saying? This is the hardest accent that I've ever had to decipher. And I've listened to some Ireland, Irish stuff. It wasn't this difficult. <laughs> the fact people differently, if you're used to it, you just get on with it, you know what it's like. But if you're not used to it, start getting depressed and all that. There's people on the land that's. I don't know what's a crack with them, just, just can't do their whack. They're locking the tension off the screws. Just, just can't do it. So this dude's been mopping his room for the whole episode. With pee water. That's a bit of anger, right? My mom's trying her hardest to get, get me out of here, because it's not here where I should be, it should be on, uh, in a mental hospital. That's sad, man. Everybody know he's supposed yeah. to be in a mental hospital. They just said it. That's why they don't punch on him. But they still walk all over him. At least qualified today. Probably someone slobbering or someone took their dinner. There would be a fair, a fair dig over that. So a fair dig fair is a fight? Oh, okay. There is my stuff that happens like people fighting over child donuts. I was fighting over a fucking potato. Five spuds. Now I did just two of them, aren't they? Right, I'm you're thinking you're gonna step me. <laughs> I don't know what you have. <laughs> He's a dab in that shit. I'm not paranoid. What are you on about your room? Hold your camera. You're a fucking hunger, ain't you? You're a fucking stinker from East Belfast. Oh, God, so tasteful. Life in somewhere like this, that's one of the things I didn't think about. Like, if there was someone that isn't hygienic, they've got to be because it affects everybody else. Right? Oh, why? Uh, you're not hygienic. You're getting the shit kicked out of you. You're getting dirty. My bucket's fucked over you. You're getting pay pay a full land number stand pissing on my bucket and throw it away. Or you're forcibly put on the shower. And if you don't like it, you don't like it. Tough shit. Be clean. Yeah, for sure, man. It's too close quarters, man. You got to be clean. We all, we all have to live. We all have to live in the same place. We all have to share this landing. Is that if there are fights, or whatever? If that word happens, either in the cells, or the showers, or no, no, no cells. cells. You see where his door is starts. You can't see from there up that far though. So it's here and where else? Where other places? The ablutions where you get a shower. Um, is that where people are beating up too? Uh, anywhere where there's no cameras, like. I've seen someone getting hit once and they were flying down the stairs and split the back of their head open. And do they not get into trouble for that? No, because you don't type. You go and type, you're going to get a hiding in your corner. I've been on a couple of things. Yeah, man, it's, just, it's still, you know, young prison, but it's still prison. 
<laughs> prison rules. You go to the infirmary or the doctor or whatever, and you get your little stitches. You get your little one, two day vacation, and you come back quietly. Big. Yeah, I spend all night, guy. I just got a big fucking bang right in the city. I mean, squeeze my ear. I caught the ear out of it for like two weeks or something. It's just the way tail is. What, why did they do that to you? Because I had a fight in someone's room and fucking blood went everywhere. Your man threw me fucking lot of blood and fucking wrecked me. <laughs> Dead all right. Well, I can see where he was coming from, Nick. At least they understand it when they get beat up. <laughs> What is this a billboard outside the cup? Oh, one of my children. I know. You'll make me coffee. Excuse me, but you're funny. You go back up to your house. Yeah, up the ladder, yeah. Up the ladder. Up the ladder. Franco. What's wrong with Franco? What Franco do? bad coffee is this really what it says out in relax with your favorite yeah right come on then look how y'all got it advertised over the yard like no nobody is All right, well, here, we said we get a chat. Are you still up for at least talking or not? What did he say? Come visit? I think so, yeah. I think the wicked boys are all crammed up though. The cream's really bad, then they're going to get bullied, Nick. So if your crime is bad, you're going to get bullied? Like, if you catch an M, you're going to get bullied for catching an M? Like, I don't think... Or do they mean like if you do something like crazy with, you know, we kind of crime and talk? That makes sense. Well, it hasn't been hot, easy for me in here, believe me. Because what I was in for, I would never raise my hand to a girl ever in my life. I wouldn't do it. That's something I wasn't born, I wasn't raised like that. Do you know what I mean? To hit wee girls. I would never do it. William was angry about how his case had been covered by the media, and he blamed me in particular. Oh, uh, okay. You're slobbering about me, Nick. I'm slobbering about what happened, but you didn't, you didn't know what happened down there, do you know what I mean, up here? But William, there was a video of it. The I, video went, I, the video I, went viral. I, Listen, mate, my mum was getting mails with people in Australia, and Wales and all, saying your son's this, your son's that. I didn't touch the wee girl once. William was convicted for a group attack on a teenage girl in a seaside town. A video of it went viral. Fair enough, I may have poured alcohol on her face. But I did not once hit that wee girl in that video. And people were trying to make it look like I did, do you know what I mean? That video's ruined my life, you know what I mean? But I actually come up. You're guilty by association. Even if you didn't hit her, you were there. You participated, you threw liquor on her. You're getting, you just get, uh, my, William, you're getting everything that you deserve. I don't feel bad for you, sir. Up here on my 18th birthday. So that. You come in. Well, happy birthday. birthday. Yeah. Can you remember that day? It's the day he was born. What you mean? <laughs> uh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. The events of the day. Oh, for, well, as soon as I walked in this place, everybody knew who it was. It's sharp and like. What was that first day like when you walked through the doors here? Like, do they reassure you? Do they make you feel safe? No. no. They, tell, they tell you if you're under threat. And I was, I was immediately told I was on, on the fret. And how soon was it until you were attacked? Street justice is a real thing, especially behind prison gates. If they don't feel like the judicial, the judicial, the judicial, the judicial system is going to bury you, or not bury you, but put you in jail and make you serve your time for your crime, and then, then the, then the, then they're going to get you in there and make you do get even worse for your time what you've done you get what i'm saying 
I'm stuttering because I got an. I'm trying to stop my Irish accent from coming up. Like five months. I opened the door, went up to get a mop bucket, came back down, and got hammered. And that's happened to me. That's happened to me on a couple of these landings, you know what I mean? I've had a few jump ones in here. Jump ones? Yeah. What's that mean? For you to be covering news and, and stuff like this all the time, you should know what jumping means. That's, that's where other people beat the fuck really. That's happened to me over that video. I thought this place was really safe. Look again, for fuck's sake. It's been, it's, it's been bad. Oh man, he's going through it for real. Look again, for fuck's sake. Look at his arms. Self-harming and everything. It's been, it's, it's been bad. It's, it's been really bad. I was, a, I was a kid when that happened. I made a mistake, do you know what I mean? People make mistakes. It's just shit that it went over all over social media and everybody knew about it. I was in the paper and all. I seen the paper and I, 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 I caught a couple of myself when I seen that paper, like. I can see them from the top of your arms down. Oh, I'm around here, over, I know. It doesn't help doing that there. But I, I, I do it to show remorse for what happened. You scar yourself to show your remorse? I mean, I want to say whatever helps, but that's a bit extreme. I hated what I'd done, I regret what I'd done. And if I could go back, I would have changed it, and she wouldn't have got touched. Do you know what I mean? I never meant for any of this to happen. And I am sorry for what I've done, like. But I'm being punished. Do you know what I mean? You've had to grow up pretty quickly, haven't you? <laughs> I know, yeah, big time. But I have grown up, and I'm not that silly wee kid no more. Do you know what I mean? I've got my priority straight since I've been in here. Your priority is better yourself and get out. This is, and stay on the straight path, that's it. I've noticed that many of the prisoners have self-harming scars. Ben! Yes? You can check me out. There's no machine. That's crazy, man. If any of my people, man, if any of y'all going through some things, man, just talk to somebody, man. Y'all on the free world, so just talk to somebody. Get through it. Watch a video or two. Not even just my video. Whatever videos that you like to watch that give you a laugh, an honest laugh, just watch. Man. Get through it. You were what? I've noticed cuts in your arms. Oh, I do. Which are quite common in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I've done up there. Tried to slice myself open. Didn't really work out the best. Can you tell me the story of what those cuts actually say? It's hard to explain. It feels like me. You're cutting the stress out, if you know what I mean. Oh, man, he's going vertical, too. That's how you really get it done. You're opening your skin for the stress to get out of your body, if you know what I mean. But you're hurting yourself. I don't know, I don't know. It, it, it's stupid. I wouldn't... I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it now, like. So I wouldn't. But I regret doing it because if I ever want a girlfriend, which I will do at some stage, but just not at the minute, they'll be like, what the fuck's all that there for? And if they, uh, I'm not going near him and all that there. That was... Get you a goth girl. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying, like... The only thing that I knew off then, and there's there's different things that I know off now. I like for the rest. I'm gonna edit that out. <laughs> hey, I don't know who that's singing that song. How long do you have left now, Ben, son? That's his pink, Ben, right? So he's down to 10 days till he gets out of this shit home, so he'll be a free man once he, once he gets this arrow. I reckon I do one once I get down to my last 50 days. 
Today we're conducting a targeted search. He's relieving that man. He's not that good, I think. Yo, don't you have to play yourself to get stuff in? Bet him a couple of times to get him off me, and then when that didn't work, I produced the knife. Self defense is whatever you're talking about, it sounds like. <coughs> there was a mad problem with that spice stuff. People running about like zombies. Um... <laughs> oh, that's it? Alright, bet it up, bet it up, bet it up. I'll take him up here on my 18th birthday. See you more. Stop. TLO, leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bell. I actually like the show. I'm not gonna lie, the, the, the dude who's doing the show, he's not talking too much. He's just letting the film come naturally, asking a couple questions. <laughs> See, some thoughts. But leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification bells, man. If you haven't, please come over to Patreon. Um, come sign up for a month, you know, $5 if you can spare it. Uh, watch everything that, you know, I can't watch here. It's tanked up. Be lit. I should be back over there posting by, I want to say, Friday, Saturday. I lost my card. I'm waiting for a new one to come in. The payment got denied. Dang. Get off me. I'm sorry.